Namo Buddhaya. Welcome to yet another episode in Inner Guide Q&A program. In life, when we are dealing with people, sometimes we get into arguments with them. Sometimes people may accuse us for so many mistakes, maybe the mistakes that have been done by ourselves and also the for the mistakes that has done by others also. So, when we are in an argument, sometimes we may face those arguments in an unsuccessful way. If you face an un argument in an unsuccessful way, you may hurt yourself as well as you may hurt the people who are complaining you. So today, we are going to find out how to face an argument and how to deal with an argument when you're being accused. So today, I need to share two useful tips that you need to practice in your life to win an argument without hurting others as well as without hurting yourself. This great advice was given by our great Arahant Sariputta. He was the chief disciple of our great teacher Supreme Buddha. So he was the great person who gave us this great advice. Our great Arhan Sariputta says, if you have been accused by someone, if you are in an argument, you need to practice these two tips. Number one, first of all, you got to be cool. You need to stay cool always. It means you should not, you should not be angry because Whenever your mind is covered or controlled by anger, Supreme Buddha taught us, if you speak out of anger, out of that anger, your words are evil. So the evil words may hurt yourself as well as to the others. And if you act out of anger, those actions will be also evil. So that actions, those actions will cause damage for others as well as for you. So first thing that you have to do when you have been accused is to be cool, to be patient, right? Don't be panicked. Don't act out of anger. You need to control your emotions. If you can control your anger, you are a great person. Because many people in this world, they cannot control their anger. They just let the anger to pass out of them. They act in anger, they speak out of anger. Don't let that happen to yourself. Because anger is not something that you should be happy with yourself. Anger is a failure. Anger is a fault. And also remember, the people who are being angry always are weak. So you should control your emotions and you should stay cool whenever you are being accused. That is the first thing that you should do. And the second tip, the second tip is you should always speak the truth. Now normally when we get into a trouble, when we, when we are in an argument, when we are being accused by someone, normally people uh, tend to speak lies, right? Because they like to escape from that problem by telling a lie. Remember, never ever lie in an argument. If something that has happened, if, if something, a mistake has happened by yourself, you need to say, that I have done this. I admit this and I admit my fault and I will correct it. So you need to stay in the truth always, right? Never ever lie. Because sometimes if we lie in an argument, if we lie when we are being accused, 
we have to say 10 more lies to cover that, to protect that lie, to save that lie. If you tell the truth, right, you don't need to remember anything anymore, right? So if you speak the truth, you don't want to remember anything. Just you say the truth and let the things happen to yourself after telling the truth, let it happen. Because bitter truth is better than sweet lies. So what you have to do, always speak the truth. Don't ever lie, right? So it will make a depression inside you, right? You need to remember everything that you said in that argument. So you need to speak this truth always. So these are the two tips to win an argument. Because if you speak truth, remember, the person who is accusing you may blame you or you will get into a trouble in your life. But remember, after that argument, after that accusation, you will win the trust of that person. Because he may start to think, this person had the opportunity to tell a lie and escape from that problem, but he did not do that. And he will get that idea that you are a person that who always speak the truth. So it is better to have the trust of the people around you. So what you have to do, you have to speak the truth. As well as, if you stay cool, people will like you very much because no one likes to be with an angry person. No one likes to associate an aggressive person. Always people like to associate people who are very cool, people who are not getting angry very much. So what you have to do, in your life, practice these two tips to win an argument. If you practice and if you master these two tips in your life, I, be, I am very sure that you can win many arguments, you can win many problems in your life when you are dealing with people, as well as you will win the trust of the people around you. Namo Buddhaya Tirvansaranaya.